a viewer's special day today, Troy. It's Anzac Day. It is. It is. Uh, so um, today we pay our respects to the men and women who fought for our freedom for this country and many of them paid with their lives so um, so we can enjoy a day off and, and go metal detecting so um, uh, our thoughts are with the families and the old diggers that passed away so um, we're going to donate a few coins to the bloke who owns the pub later on, a couple of pennies, they're playing two up down there, that'll be good. Uh, it will be. And the second special thing about today is we've got private permission. We have, we have. At a primary school dating to 1880s, Troy? Yeah, 1884, I think it is. Yeah, so um, get on and uh, happy Anzac Day. Right. Viewers, we're here on Anzac Day morning and Troy, you got a target there, mate. I do. Ooh. Sounds all right. It does. What are you thinking? <laughs> Trying to be quiet with that coil, but it's not happening there with that sound on. This sounds pretty good, mate. It did sound the hell is that? That's not it, is it? No. No, I didn't oh, think. Oh, there it is. Where? What the? Oh, That's brother. What? It's a roux, is it? Um, I don't think so, because it was... Or is it a token? What have you got on Anzac Day, mate? Oh, no, it is a roux. Oh, it's a roux. It is a roux. Heavens to Mercatroy. Yep. What do you got? Oh, stop it, Troy! That could be a little silver, I hope. Oh, yeah. Right there, I think it is. Oh, there it is. Uh, it's not a it's coin. A fitting. That is. Come with me, mate. Come with me, heavens to Merca, Troy. Let's take the viewers over here. Okay. 12.42. A little bit of depth about it. Oh god, it is actually really. <sighs> Look how dry it is, Troy. It's out. Right now, around here you want to watch out when you bend over because there's bloody prickles everywhere. There is. Penny. It's a commie one as well. And. Uh, 22, I think that is. Now, let's try and pinch zoom or something like that, Troy. I don't know how it's going to work, but. It's gone funky lately, my camera. Get him all right? 1922. Oh, well done. No Put worries. A dancer on it. I'm on the board. You are. <laughs> Viewers, I'll just give you a little sneak peek on what I dug. There you go, little ram's head shilling. Ram's head shilling. What year's that one, mate? Uh, 46 by the looks of that. Troy, mate. Good stuff. It's not bad, righty oh, first silver, or half silver, pretty happy with that, righto, 49. 49 half penny. Nice little coin, Troy, mate, well it done. Righto. Troy, mate, you found something relevant for the day, Anzac Day? Oh, yes and, yes and no. We've got a red cross badge. A red cross badge, hold it right there, mate, that's awesome. Which I, I suppose the red cross had a um, big part during the wars, didn't they? Yeah, they did, that's cool, that's Troy, well done, mate. Uh, you're doing your part for today. I hope so. Great. <laughs>
coinage. I think I've just seen it. I think I've just seen it right there. I can see it, is it? Yep. See it? That's him. There he is. Looks like just a penny, Troy, does it? It does. A crusty old penny. That's oh, a commie. And it is from... Oh, God, I just about had a heart attack then. Can you see the date on that? 1933. I thought the three was a zero. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? That would have been right on Anzac Day, Troy. It certainly would have been. Could have shouted the bar. Right up. 10.42, could be another penny or something 10.42, like could be a penny. Not very deep. And look how hard that is, mate. Serious. Oh. Is that going to be a two cent piece? No. No. It's a commie. Let me zoom in on him, see if I can get a... She's a bit crustified over the date there. Oh, I just made it worse. Anyway, I'll get it out of there. That's where he was living. 21, I think. Is that right? It is 21. Jeez, we're finding a few coins, Troy, mate. Yeah, we we're doing all right. Get on. We can play two up now. We can. We've got plenty. 22, well done. We might just give you a big round up at the end and then just film every other real good one. Righto. Troy, mate, you look like bloody gorillas in the mist. Gorillas in the mist. Have a look. <laughs> What'd you get? A button. Oh, that's... Oh, well done, mate. That's massive. Huge button. That could be off like a fireman's jacket or something. Got nothing written on it? No, but it looks like it was gold gilded or whatever at one point in time. Flip him over, mate, and show me the little Shawshank. Uh, yeah, actually, is that something written in there? Yeah, it probably will be. Well done, something. Back here, viewers, just dug that. It's a bit of a lower tone, actually, but I reckon it's a later sixpence. It's silver, for sure. And yes, it is. Alrighty, what have we got? 53. Well done. That's all right, Troy, mate. It is. Don't know if I've ever found a 53 before. Anyhow, we'll take that. Anyway, there you go. 53 sixpence. I just said to Troy, let's go back to where we were finding all the coins and yee-haw, Grandma. Righto. Sounds pretty good, though. Uh, no, it's a, it's a bit of a lower number than mine. And sounds a bit more like a penny, I reckon. Could be a bloody one or two cent piece, too. Could be. No, there it is, it's a penny. It's a penny whereabouts, Yeah, mate. right here, mate. You won't be able to... Oh, okay, I can... Let me see flopping. him on his edge. See him now? Yep. Probably about to see what we've got, mate. It's another commie, mate. Now, let's try and do this. Did it work? 1934. Oh, geez, we're not far off of the, you know what? The right year, are we? Yeah. Right up. Well the viewers, I've just dug myself one of those little token badgy thingies that the school kids get. Oh, it is too. Oh, it's got the little thing on it and everything. A loop. Oh, shit. Can you hold it, Troy? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good, isn't it, mate? There's a bit of a look, mate. Now, let's see if this stupid... My phone's been playing funny buggers lately. Um, anyway, it's a commemorative badge to um, celebrate the... What was it, Troy? I think this one was the... I can't read it off this one, but off memory, I think this one was the opening of Parliament. Yeah. Not bad, eh, mate? I'll clean him up and take a picky, but that sounded like a penny, that thing, so... I'm super happy with that little sucker. We I said reckon. we might find one today, and we did. Did, that's it. Right up. viewers Troy dug that tiny little plug and he recognized that and then he said there it is now I'll try and do this 
carefully. That's a little English halfer, I reckon, 1889. That's it's awesome, Troy. It is, isn't it? It's still in the ground there. Yeah, you do the honours, mate. That is excellent. Oh, jeez. Quite firm in there. Oh. You're right, mate? Yep. Oh, well done, Troy, mate. Uh, oh, shit, where are you? Going all funky there. What the? Hold it right there. Oh, my God, that's actually in really good nick. Now that's more of the dates we're looking for, bro. That is. Right, oh, well done, Troy, mate. Back here, viewers. Troy, what do you got, mate? Ninety-three, ninety-four. Yeah, this was nice. This it was twelve forty-six on the e-track, and we have dug one there. So I just oh, got. There. Just goes to show that you've got to sort of check your environment, don't you, mate? You certainly do. I wonder. Oh, I hope it's not a one or two. Oh, oh yes, you Troy, you got a shilling. You ripper. That was a nice tone. What is it? Old one or Aussie? Aussie, mate. Oh, it could be old, is it? It's an Aussie, Aussie, it mate. It's an old one. Well old done, Aussie, Troy. just before the ram's head. Happy with that? I think that says 1917. Just hold it right there, bro. 1917, good coin, that's your first silver. It is for the date here today. I you? need one of them. Viewers, I hope everyone had a happy uh, and um, safe Anzac day. Anyhow, this is a little bit of a wrap up on how me and Troy went today. Um, the old bloody E-Track did all right today on the pennies and bits and pieces. So there's a Porsche, Buckle, heap of pennies and bloody uh, commie pennies there. The silvers, I found a ram's head shilling and a little sixpence there some weird little button thing with the shank there that was all right heaps of one and two cent pieces oh my god a dollar coin and that commemorative parliament federal parliament badge thing troy badgy thingy they gave to the school kids that was pretty good troy's found a um what was it troy a south african penny, penny. a south african penny i'll be oh and while i've got you there just want to show you this little coin. That was a Canadian, is it a one cent piece, Troy? Canadian one cent. How's that in amongst all the other little bits and pieces? Troy's found some cool relics. Now, I love this button. We're not really sure what it says. I think it's got London or something written on the back of it, Troy. Yeah. And that was pretty cool. Tiny little um, Aussie Military Forces button there. And now these two are two Red Cross badges. They are. Which is really... Although the top one's missing the centrepiece out of it. I don't know mm. what the centrepiece would have been. Might have been a stone or something like that in there. Who knows? But that's pretty cool. Um, now, I love this coin. 1889. That's the oldest. That was nice. And Troy's also found a heap of um, pennies and one and two cent pieces. And your little shilling that's gone a bit funky now, Troy. Yeah, uh, 1917 Melbourne Mint Mark on that one. So that was pretty good. That was your only silver for today. But that's a nice coin. It's a little bit damaged. But all in all, um, hang on. What is going on with my phone? And why is it doing that? There we go. All in all, not bad. And uh, yeah, righto. See ya.